how is it? So, obsidian for hackers, for dog bounty hunter, for pen tester, for nodes. Let's switch to the next slide. What is obsidian? Uh, obsidian is a great note taking among, among all applications that I have. I generally use every note taking applications. It it is available on Android, iOS, and Windows. How can you say Obsidian is based in all apps? Yeah, I can say it with my play because when I started taking notes, uh, I I will firstly start with Obsidian. I think I have to use more apps for taking notes and understand what suits me best. It's three months to use uh, every note taking app, and I switch over to the Obsidian again. So the next slide is about I tried Obsidian, Notion, Evernote, Jetry, and Sublime Text and Xmind. Xmind is also great, but for those who have subscription, who have subscription, and I have not subscription nowadays. Obsidian has also has an option for mind map. But wait, why it suits you best? because of vim keys vim key is an editor which is more faster than other editors colon q is for exit without saving the vim without saving the file in vim and colon q or exclamation for forcefully exit without saving the file and for saving and exit you can use colon wq it these keys used after escape button when you hit escape button and a later form you can use it three keys and our next slide is about obsidian has great themes yep they have very great themes it's presentation option now i am using in this video it's presentation and the great hotkeys yes it has a very very great hotkeys for for uh, easier way to describe something for presentation I use control shift plus P for boxes I use you can and it's by default control plus enter you can see this box is empty for control plus enter and if you hit enter once again you can see it's filled up with this tick for uh, preview or edit mode you can use control plus E it's again by default key and the next slide is about Sometimes we need our audios. Yeah, we have our audio options for a specific topic or something. If we can record a voice for taking notes, we can use it. For this, I have control plus A, and for stopping this recording, I have control plus space. So I, I have set these options for my customization. Use the dash, and you will write the points built points notes, and use of graph i can show you how to use graph let's go back and hit ctrl plus c you can see all my topics or in every folders every topic every file is in dot presented if i can zoom it everything is a file so if i go to, i hit ctrl plus o to go my for quick switch for to go my file and this is my file which I can show you the presentation if I go next next presentation is about how and the control plus G is for all in whole whole folders of all files as graph these are if I want to know the graph of this only this particular file i can hit control set plus c and you can see it right control plus w to exit it and i can use control plus alt plus a for animation like this type every every dotted point is a file or some topics and now i can use control plus for switching what is our next topic next topic is about like uh, for toggle block code use greater than sign then start writing something like this so the syntax of coding this is a block code 
and for coding this is also for the obsidian is also great for coding you can use it something like this i can show you a block code or coding this is a code button when you add editing when you writing something the code has this triple i don't know what is this called triple it's just bottom of below the escape key you can use it double times and between these you have the quote okay so let's go our next slide is about our next slide uh, is about doing uh, do you want to see my tables yeah. i generally open i have generally Even all the plugins, code plugins or developer plugin, a developer plugin has a mind map, so I can use this for setting this. These are the plugins, and these are community plugins. I recently opened mind map for developers. These plugins. Now switch to the next slide. What is this? The next slide is about. Why are you not describing function of every key, hotkey? I'm not describing because if you go with your server deeply, you can know very, very better than this. And I use it for I don't see any uh, any watch video for this. I just know for myself generally. After digging myself, how to add an image or embed or PDF. You can see it. How can I? embed it and you can also spread like the terminal if you use call linux or linux terminals you can see it if i want it in this type you can see it's something like this this is a terminal this is my my image and the semicolon double square bracket between the square bracket you can put your name of image and the extension of the image and for video you can have seen and this is the thing what i use for my how oh, i embed it you can see it This is the image which I and this is a PDF of my certification of Crossover. Crossover is a is a coding by Google app. It can teach you the coding. Next is auto fix size. You have to use the for the size. You have to use something something like this. Mm -hmm. Occurs and this previous image is with the pole 300 and 200 its height and width. You can see it. And for web images, you can use this alt text 200 and your love image. In the but remember this is in the uh, not in the square bracket. This is in uh, short brackets or or the alt text and pole with the size in. Square. How can you embed videos in your previous ones? I can tell you. How can you embed? It? But let's go to the slide for it. How can you embed? Let's see it here. And I show you the how web images you can embed. For this, I will open my. Some examples, here. and here we go. We have our yeah. This is another fine same file. For this, I use this thing. Embedding previous one, something text like um, image. You have just uh, exclamation mark, double square brackets, and between these square bracket you have a file. Now go to embedding a video. For embedding video, if you know how to code, you know it. Iframe, and this is the source. If you can't see it, I can bigger it, make the size bigger, and hopefully you can see it. And you can also 
Twitter and red Twitter and you see it this is my Twitter and this is my YouTube the Twitter is something like this this is my Twitter Dashula it is extreme right now follow me on Twitter hopefully you can understand how can we use my You can know how I use Obsidian as a organizer for content. For more help, you can use F1 and Obsidian to know for help and better. Thank you. Bye. And thanks for watching. Hopefully, you learned something.